The Senate will now come to order. Will all senators, guests, and staff please rise for this morning's invocation and remain standing for the Pledge of Allegiance? This morning's invocation will be given by the Honorable Senator Ken Horn from the 32nd District. Dear Father in Heaven, as you know, Lord, I have two grandchildren living with me at home. And it seems that our young children have a way of making us look at Christmas with a set of fresh eyes. As I was making out my gift list, it occurred to me, Father, that I needed to add your name to my list. After all, you gave us the ultimate gift this month, the miracle of your son, Jesus. I must be honest, though, it's awfully, hum it's awfully humbling experience, Lord, trying to put together a list of things that you might need. After all, what do you give to somebody that has everything? It seems we make a regular habit of asking things of you. We are human after all. So today, in return for the gift of your Son and the Holy Spirit, we offer these gifts to you. We will strive to discern the difference between being smart and being wise, being patient and, and having true patience, between asking for peace and being a person at peace. And of course, we will try to distinguish the difference between hearing our colleagues and really understanding them. As we count down the days of Christmas, help guide us to be generous of heart at home and courageous leaders in this chambers as we work toward a common solution to the many issues facing our great state. May all this, all this be done on this day and be a gift to glorify and honor you. So in the name of your newborn son, the man he grew to be, and to the Holy Spirit, which guides our intentions. We pray. Amen. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, 